Back now on Most Buffalo, we heard from Ron Plants earlier in the half hour about how the city's getting ready for March Madness. The teams were practicing today and getting ready for the games to begin tomorrow. Brian Shinaki talked with some of the coaches and joins us now with more. Well, these blue seats behind me are usually filled with Sabres fans, but for the first time since 2017, they're going to be filled with college basketball fans. That's because the March Madness tournament has returned to Buffalo. Now, first impression so far being here at Key Bank Center, it's nice. Masks are off unless you're on courtside. And overall, it just seems like the COVID restrictions are limited as we get to the tail end of this pandemic, which creates a, a little bit more of a fun and exciting atmosphere and vibe. Now, as far as the tournament itself and what you can expect here in Buffalo, I don't want to go into axes and O's in the games itself. And the reason for that is because I know a lot of you guys are probably not invested into the outcomes of these games unless you have a family member on one of the teams, unless you bet a lot of money on one of these teams going deep in your bracket. So instead, I want to show you guys the flavor of the March Madness tournament right here in Buffalo. Of all the cities you guys could have been playing in, you get Buffalo, New York. Yeah. Is, is that a jackpot win for you? I mean, I've never been to Buffalo, so I don't really know what to expect, but uh, I, I, for me, it's a cool city because I'm not really used to big cities, so. Are you from Buffalo, Deb? I'm not from Buffalo. Well, by marriage, I'm from Buffalo. My husband, Jeff Shulman, who's the athletic director of Vermont, is from Buffalo, so it's nice to be back. How exciting was that when you guys had Selection Sunday and then all of a sudden you see, wow, we're going back to Western New York? Yeah, he's, he was ecstatic. We're all really happy. So I randomly ran into your wife and the word she used was ecstatic. Describe the last three days to me and being back in Buffalo, that must feel amazing. Well, first of all, you know, obviously thrilling for our team to be in the NCAA championship. Mark Madness is so special. And then for me, when I saw Buffalo pop up as our site, uh, it obviously has incredible personal significance for me. Buffalo is just a huge part of, of my life. Anybody who knows me well knows how important Buffalo is to me. And to be able to combine March Madness and our basketball team success with my hometown is, is really special. It's a real big thing. It reminds me of when I was a kid when I used to go over to the R to see the Buffalo Braves play. And if you are interested in coming out, the tournament starts on Thursday at 12.40 p.m. Four-seeded Providence takes on 13-seed South Dakota State. From Key Bank Center, Brian Shinaki, Channel 2 Sports.